Hey, beautiful people. This is So So Models' last video of 2019. Oh my gosh. Like, we about to enter into a new decade. I'm excited. I am super excited because the month of December, I just been chilling, relaxing, letting my mind flow so I can go into 2020 feeling easy, breezy, beautiful comfortable feels. Um, I'm stupid. But wow, like wow, a lot has happened in this past decade. I mean, a whole lot. Come on, like 2010, I was in college. Starting my, what was I in the middle? Of? I was in the middle of my sophomore year of college. Yeah, at UCF, University of Central Florida. Woo woo! I started working at Charm and Charlie part time. 2011, I was in my junior year, still working at Charm and Charlie, just trying to really, really knock this school thing out. 2012, I finally graduated from college and I, started working for a construction company. At the end of 2012, I had my first photo shoot. I was like, I hit him my whole life I'm like, oh, you know, you're a photographer for you? Yeah, give me his info. I'm gonna do a photo shoot. That's what I did. In 2013, y'all, I took off. I took off. I took off. I took off. No, like 20. I really like to go. Like I really like went hard with the modeling. 2013, I also did my big chop. Chop. That was, I don't even know if that was a chop sound. Whatever that was. I did my big chop. And um look at me now. Hey, look at me now. Now I still be feeling like my hair should be longer. But that's another story for another day. 2014, I kept going at it, kept going at it. I had a feeling that I needed to go somewhere else, like in pursuit of this modeling, because I felt like Orlando just was not the place for me. I was submitted to agencies in New York, and I also brought up Atlanta. I remember I brought up Atlanta to my mom. I'm like, I was like, why not Atlanta? They seem like, you know, that'd be a good market for me for modeling. And she said that there would be a lot of competition. So once she said that, like, I never had a thought again. 2015, I came to Atlanta to visit. <laughs> Ended up moving to this drone. And it's been great. I love it here in Atlanta. The opportunities started flowing in. I just start networking for usual and get to know people and take risks. Um, there have been good days and bad days, but y'all know how the game go. 2016, I did my very first commercial. Like, y'all, when I tell you that was the best day ever, that was like one of the best days I've ever had. On that day, on that good old day in July 2016, I knew I wanted to act. Like, I had so much fun, like, literally being myself in front of a camera as it's rolling. It's different from a photography camera versus doing, um, same thing, a camera. But you know, it's different from doing a photo shoot to actually doing a commercial. So it was a lot of movements, laughter, fun. Like, I just had a really, really great day. And from that day, I was like, yo, like, I want to do more of this. I need to do more of this. Um, 2017 is when I started taking acting classes at the Premier Actors Network here in Atlanta, Georgia. And um, what else did I do that year, y'all? I started getting involved in independent films. So um, working with people around the city of Atlanta on their films to get to get my <laughs> to get my <laughs> to get my toes wet. <laughs> I'm so stupid. But not to get my to get my toes wet and you know, get more comfortable in front of the camera. Um, 2018, uh, the year of 28. What happened in 2018? Doing a lot of independent projects, you know, studying the craft with people outside of just going to class. We were studying outside of class and, and making films outside of class. So that was all good stuff. 2019, 2019, along with modeling all those years too. I'm sorry, I'm leaving out what I, what I be doing. Along with modeling. All those years on photo shoots. Fashion shows definitely started to slow down. I think 2017, maybe the last time I did like a fashion show. But all I've really been doing as far as um, runway is bridal because I love bridal. 
<laughs> Hubby, where you at? Um, I love bridal modeling. I love putting on gowns. It's y'all know I've talked about in prior videos. I, I just love it. I love doing my bridal stuff. Fast forward. Now we are in the year of 2019, baby. What happened in 2019, y'all? What happened in 2019? So so started her YouTube channel, So So Models. Thank you so much to everyone who subscribed, to everyone who has watched, to everyone who has liked, to everyone who has shared, to everyone who has commented. I truly, truly appreciate y'all. Let me tell y'all something. This was not even on my goals for this year to start a YouTube channel. I don't, I don't know how I started. I was just like, there I got this content on my phone. Why am I not like uploading it? Like I have great video content. Um, last year, when I got my iPhone, I started editing videos, editing videos, but I wasn't posting anything. So, um, this year, I was like, why don't I do something new for my modeling career? You know, like, you just gotta try new things and see what works and what doesn't work. And I love doing my videos. It's therapeutic for me. Like, sitting there, I go through my footage and, like, editing it. It takes work, but it's, like, therapeutic, like, just to see how I start... At the top of the day, looking rough. <laughs> Out there here in makeup. <laughs> Bam. Wham, bam. Thank you, ma'am. So, I love seeing my transformations. Um, and I just love seeing stuff that goes on behind the scenes and sharing it with you all. Thank you all so much for watching. I'm so proud of myself. I just literally, with this channel, I just did it. Still trying to figure it out and all that jazz. But I'm doing it. And that's the important thing I'm doing it. Also this year I signed with a talent agent for um, my acting for Sofa TV and Film. I have an agent that represents me. Um, what else? I've been able to audition for some great things this year which I'm truly truly grateful for. Don't worry bookings are coming. Hold on. Pause. Bookings have been made. So this year I filmed the episode of Fatal Attraction playing one of the leads. It comes out in February. I will keep y'all posted. It comes out on TV One in February. So I'll keep y'all posted on that. Um, that is something I wrote down on my, well, both those things I wrote down on my, um, my goals for 2019 was to obtain an agent and to market myself as a leading actress. So come on somebody, write it, speak it, believe it. So this year I did four projects where I was the lead, so I'm truly, truly grateful for that. And of course, many other projects where I was supporting. Sometimes you gotta support, and sometimes you gotta lead the way. Hey, you gotta lead the way. Hey, but yeah, this year was a very, very good year. Um, man, when I tell you I've been rocking and rolling all year. I've been rocking and rolling. So she rock to the trees up all day long. Yeah, I've been rocking and rolling like this whole year, like going nonstop. So I took this last month of the year to take some time to reflect, to settle down, and to get right for 2020. I'm ready, y'all. I'm ready, y'all. Oh, and another one of the things that I wrote down on my 2019 goals was to eat more fruits and veggies. And this in May this year is when I moved over to the semi-vegan lifestyle. Um, I say 98% vegan, 2% other. That 2% other is because when I go out to eat, you know, like people be like, there's no dairy and stuff, but you just never really know. You just never really know. Unless you're cooking at home all the time. And I just, I don't have that luxury. Or unless you have a personal chef, I don't have that luxury yet. A personal vegan chef. But anywho, man, 2019 has been a good year. I'm excited for 2020. I got my goals written down. I'm feeling pumped, pumped, pumped up. It was good to take this month off, y'all. I needed it for my mental health, for my physical health, for my social health. Like, I've been more social. <laughs> Thank you all so much for tuning in to my last video of 2019. I will see all you beautiful people in 2020. 2020. I will see y'all in a new decade. Thank you so, so much for everything. Y'all look great. Y'all look great. Thank you all for 2019. See y'all in 2020.